Today is the solemn and joyful day when Katie will be given in marriage to Scott. And what a wonderful day it is. And right now hearts are beating fast and nervous excitement is just coursing through your veins. And that is the way it should be. This is exciting. But in all the excitement of this moment, take a deep breath. Let all your senses take in all of the wonder of today. Take a good look at this person across from you. They are here to commit their whole life to you. I, Scott, take you, Katie, to be my wife. I, Katie, take you, Scott, to be my husband. I promise before God and these witnesses to be your faithful wife, to be your faithful husband, to share with you in plenty and in want, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health, to forgive and strengthen you, and to join with you so that together we may serve God and others as long as we both shall live. So as you, Scott, and you, Katie, have entered into this covenant of holy marriage by the virtue of the authority vested in me as a minister of the gospel, I now gladly pronounce you husband and wife in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. What God has joined together, let no one separate. Scott, you may kiss the bride. It's now my great joy and my privilege to present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Scott McFadden. I can't think of a better person on the face of the planet to be Katie's husband. Scott puts Katie and others before himself. He's very bright and one of the most conscientious people I know. I'd like to toast Katie and Scott. With this day behind you, the real journey begins. May God guide you on every step. Here's to Katie and Scott.